Here we have a variety of leaves. And if you said my job was to split these leaves into just two groups based on which are more similar and which are more different, probably many people would solve the problem the same way. I would say this over here is a group because these are simple objects. They're just one flat sheet. These are more complex. They seem to be made up of many parts. But what if someone in the room is really dubious, they're skeptical, and they say, no, you're not looking at it right, you picked them wrong, you should have in fact picked this one here instead of down here, and now this, well, it seems to belong over there. Same, it could be down over here instead of picking it here. Maybe someone should say, nope, you have to pick it right there. Now this belongs over here, and so on and so forth. You could keep going, and the whole system would fall apart, and everything would belong over here. But there is actually a reason why these leaves belong over here and these leaves belong over here. But I will say for the skeptic that this kind of difference isn't necessarily obvious. It has to do with the leaf anatomy, the plant's anatomy that we can't always see or understand with the naked eye unless we look at things a little more closely and know a little more. But what we should be considering here is that the bud, when this was a, just a bud on the tree, the bud was down here, and the same kind of bud was happening over here. And it's not the same as what was happening up here. The bud was down here, and it's not the same as what's happening up there. This part down the middle of the leaf is the same or analogous as what's down the middle of this object over here with the three parts. Same over here. This whole piece is analogous to this. So by that reasoning, we can keep our simple group over here, which is actually what they're called, simple leaves. And over here, we have something else. We'll call these compound leaves. They are made of many parts. This is one leaf. It has three leaflets. This is also one leaf. It has seven leaflets. Compound and simple leaves.